Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I'd share a quick little video with some of my home organization ideas and tips and tricks. I've been spending a lot of time getting our home organized over the last few months and decluttering and labeling and organizing. And I feel like I've got a few ideas and tips that I can share. So let's jump straight into it. So the first idea I wanted to share with you is getting some canisters or jars to store all your coffee and tea and sugar and all that stuff in. So I got these ones from Kmart a few years ago and I just love them. They're such a good size and they look so nice all stacked up together on the kitchen bench. So I'm just going to make some labels for these with my Cricut machine. So in the Cricut design space, I'm just creating some little labels with tea, coffee, hot chocolate, sugar, all those things for my jars. And I'm then grabbing some white vinyl material and just gonna place that down on the mat and get my Cricut to cut that out. And I just love watching it cut, it's so satisfying. So once those little labels are done, I'm gonna cut them out and then just weed out all the little bits in between the text. I'm then grabbing some transfer tape and I'm going to peel that back and then transfer the labels over onto my canisters. And don't these just look super cute? I love how they turned out. I think the white on the wooden lid looks so nice and just really pops and they go really well with our kitchen and they look so nice all stacked up together on the kitchen bench. So the next area that I've organized in our home is our laundry and I really don't like looking at products just in their containers. So I bought these matching glass jars and tubs for our washing powder, nappy sand and softener. And I just think these look so much better. I actually want to display them out on the laundry bench because they look really nice together and I don't wanna just hide the containers away in a drawer. And I'm really happy with how they turned out. So the next idea for the kitchen is organizing your rice and pasta and things that you use or foods that you grab for quite often. So I bought these matching glass jars which come in all different sizes and they've also got the same wooden lids and I just think they look so nice. So I'm filling them up here with the different types of rice and then I'm just going to pop them on the bench in our kitchen. And don't they look great all lined up together? I could label these, but I don't know. I might hold off for a little while. <laughs> The next idea is to use baskets like these ones to organize some of your items. So we had some things in our kitchen which were just getting in the way. I didn't really have a home for them and they were really just adding clutter to the kitchen. So things like barbecue utensils, which we don't use all that often, but you do kind of want to keep them together. And also like protein shakers and water bottles, I find are really annoying because they kind of fall over a lot we were keeping them on top of our fridge and they're just they get in the way and Joel really likes to keep stubby holders which I don't really see the need for holding on to like 20 different stubby holders but anyway he won't let me throw them out so at least they're all organized together now and I don't have to worry about them falling all over the place when I go to grab something off the top of the fridge <laughs> The last little home organization idea I have for you today is for organizing bathroom appliances. So this is another thing that I was finding they just kind of get in the way and they're really annoying to have on the bathroom bench. So I got this little caddy thing from Kmart and it is the perfect size to fit underneath our bathroom bench. And I of course labeled it as well with my Cricut machine. And I'm just putting all our bathroom appliances in here like my hair straightener, hair dryer, Joel's shaver. So this is just a much better idea for keeping all of our bathroom things nice and neat and tidy. So guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you got some ideas about how you can organize your home as well. Let me know if you like this style of video, if you want to see more home organization tips and tricks. And make sure you subscribe if you want to come along on this journey with me in organizing our home and getting my life in order because I've been vlogging the whole process. So yes, thank you guys for watching. I love you and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.